Yeah, I'm um, continuing on, man. And um, yeah, it says, and they shall take them captives whose captives they were, and they shall rule over them, man. You know, and the reason I title the, the the lesson is um, um, you know, the irony of emancipation. LOL is because um, the, according to the definition, emancipation means to be let free from slavery, man. But really and truly, when you go into it, it's only a transfer of ownership, okay? But at the end of the day, um, at the end of the day, so like, I think the camera's a bit fuzzy, let me just... Yeah. At the end of the day, man, um, uh, what's the point? You know, some Edomites, man, you're, listen, Esau got, even, even Esau got Esau in oppression, man, you know, like your elites don't even care about you, man, like if you were the top sect and then everybody else, but no, Esau even got Edomites in oppression, man, you know, and you, you're technically already in captivity, man, you got Edomites so-called living the curses, <laughs> well not the curses, but the financial curses then, that Jake have, man, you know, and you're going to get that and worse in the kingdom, man. That's why it's, it's, it's so much for emancipation, man, freedom, because Esau, some of you are already enslaved. Some of you want to give up the ghost already, man, you know, and I remember, I remember at, um, the last Passover, man, we did a sit down video and, um, <laughs> you know, I brought out one scripture in the sit down and um, I said, um, you know, there will be no suicide in the kingdom, man. You die when I say so, you know. <laughs> and we kind of mentioned that at camp the other day and had a little bit of a laugh about it. But, you know, that's the truth, man. You know, in the kingdom, there ain't going to be no suicide, man. There ain't going to be, oh, um, one Edomite escaped from the dungeons and he's waiting to run in front of a, 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 a horse and cart and kill himself. No, man. Okay? It ain't going to happen, period. But let's just say... In an imaginary world, it did. Guess what? We have the power to bring your spirit back down into your body. So you can feel more pain. And then you die when we want you to. You know? That's just how it is, man. That's just how it is. You know? Okay? That's how we say it's going to be a transfer from bad to worse, man. You know? And Yahweh Shai said, those who will not have me rule over them, bring them ever before me and slay them, man. Okay? And Edomites don't, they, listen, like I said, the top sector Esau, because they're level to this thing, they know about the Lord. Okay? But they don't want Yahweh Shai to rule over them, man. So what are we going to do? We're going to do what Yahweh Shai Hamashiach said, man. In, in the scriptures, we're going to bring them hither and slay them before me, man. You know? So it's a transfer from bad to worse for Esau, man. It's a transfer from bad to worse, you know? So it's not looking bright, man. And the spirit has me, you know, the last couple of days, man, getting onto Esau, man. It's not looking bright. Because Esau want to be bringing out all these new technologies and shit. Shit that they haven't released to us, the general population, <laughs> you know? But at the end of the day, man, you know, it's over for Esau, bro. It's, it's actually, they're, they're finished, man, you know? And we gotta continue pushing that man, because each time we pray that, each time we make a video on that, each time we read it out the scriptures, first and foremost, you know, so like yeah, that should have been first. But each time we bring it out, man, that's the vibration, man. One word closer, one breath closer, man. One step forward to the downfall of this kingdom, man. You know? But anyways, man, you know, I brought out three scriptures. You know, that it's going to get worse for them. And there's a lot more I could do, you know. But I just wanted to use this little article, you know, as a a, a, a secular source to even show you, man, that, you know, economically, the GDP, which is the gross domestic product, man, people ain't contributing the, the percentage that they should be, you know. And, and, and overall, that brings the economy down, man, you know. And like I said for the spirit, I'm going to do a video on how economics bears witness to the downfall of this kingdom, man. You know? But with that, man, I'm going to say shalom. Okay? By the end of the day, man, it's over, man. It's over, Esau. <laughs> you know? Brother, brother Esau, brother Esau think he got 
2090, 3090. It ain't happening, man. Your economics, your own economics is showing you, man, that it's over, man. You know, it's over, okay? But anyways, man, you know, I said my piece. So with that, I'm going to say Shalom.